What's going on guys? Got me a new little project here. Um, I was going to get another Delta Force or something, but I was looking around on Offshore Electrics and the little Blackjack 24s are what, only 230 bucks now with free shipping. So I was like, you know, I've always been kind of curious to see an Ironclad making them pretty quick. And I know these stock motors can handle more than what they're rated for. Uh, I used to have a little Shockwave 26, same motor, and actually used to run that on 6S. So I know it can take it. This boat's a little lighter, so hopefully it doesn't get hot. Um, yeah, I figured I'm not even going to bother running it on the 3S with the stock 30 Dynamite. Um, so I, I just went ahead and bought some upgrades for it before it even hit the water. Uh, you can see here, got upgraded cooling. So now we got dual cooling, got an upgraded strut. Uh, I'm going to try running this 40 millimeter 1.6 and see how that does. It's detongued, so I'm hoping that'll help spool the motor up a little easier. I actually really like the way this upgraded strut looks in black. I think that's pretty clean. Um, I'll show you what I did on the inside so far. Upgraded the ESC already. Uh, let's see. Yeah. So I've got a 150 amp OSE. Got a nice little spot here for my Sky RC uh, GNSS little uh, GPS here still running stock motor I got the different flex shaft as well um, 0.150 so we'll see how that works it looks like I'm gonna have to probably put some velcro down in the sponsons um, so I can mount two three S's but yeah hopefully this thing flies I'm not really expecting you know ridiculous speed out of this with the stock motor but with 6s maybe in the 50s um, I know it's not going to be able to compete with my dad's Bayless, but it should be a fun little boat to just rip around. Uh, honestly, pretty impressed for the price point. The hull does not feel like it's real cheap at all. It's like kind of hard to squeeze, to be honest. Pretty good little ABS, or uh, I'm not quite sure what it is. It might be. Yeah, not sure. I mean, maybe it is ABS, but not a bad plastic hull at all. Tried to make everything look nice and neat and clean. I'm not sure how it's going to run with my ESC towards the back, but I did put it on the left side, figuring that would help with some of the torque roll. Because so It looks like from all the videos I've watched, this thing likes to roll over to the right, especially with a bigger prop. So we'll try it out. Um, I figured I'd leave all that space down there for the battery so I can move them forward and backward if needed. Um, yeah, this should be a fun little addition to the channel and just to my fleet. Um, I'll probably have a couple more boats later on. Um, I still have to finish my Delta Force uh, 26, and I'm still looking, you know, around for maybe another catamaran or maybe another Delta Force, but a little bit bigger hull. But we'll see what happens. But yeah, that's it for now until I uh, get this thing on the water, hopefully next week, and then we'll see how it goes. All right, have a good one, guys.